What's up everybody, my name is Mr. Ultra Gamer, and today Fortnite has released new patch notes for the new mythic items, the War Machine Arsenal and the Captain America Shield, as well as the the, the new shotgun as well. So if you guys want to find out, please like and subscribe and let me know how you guys feel about this video because I'm going to start pulling out videos like this from now on. So if you guys like it, please like and subscribe and let me know. And to start things off, it looks like Fortnite Status, the account of Twitter, uh, released a statement uh, about the, you know, some nerfs that they're gonna do for the mythic items and the, you know, the items for Captain America Shield and our War Machine's Arsenal, us also for the Sovereign Shotgun too. So it seems like, um, you know, some changes because it seems like the the first couple of days, this these two weapons, especially the Captain America Shield. And War Machine's jetpack has been completely destroying the Fortnite, you know, competition. And since the the shield has really good um, homing um, attacks, you know, you don't really have to aim at someone to really hit them with the shield. But here it says um, the Sovereign shotgun aims down sights more quickly. So I basically, uh, I guess it aims way more quicker than it should be, and it fires faster while doing so. So if you sh if you basically aim the gun, you basically just shoot it way quicker. And with Captain America's shield, it does slightly less damage, and it will require more accuracy to hone in on an enemy, and staggers more quickly when blocking damage. So it seems like um, it takes way more aim, and you know, um, basically aiming to hit your uh, opponents with a shield. So that's gonna need more accuracy, and also I guess it gets uh, knocked back really easily, just like how it was with Chapter One. Or not chapter one um, season just like how it was in chapter uh, five season one with the uh, the pistol and right shield so that's pretty uh, interesting and with war machines arsenal it seems like it deals slightly less damage to structures and takes longer to reload which is understandable because like literally they have like I believe six missiles or six or eight missiles that are launched out to you when it's full when it's fully loaded so that's insane and I guess it takes less damage on structures, so it wouldn't completely destroy your building with the rockets. And it, it seems like it takes longer to reload the rockets as well. And I guess, you know, um, that's, a, that's a pretty good update. I, I'd say that's pretty good, uh, at least in my opinion, because uh, through my experience of playing this season so far, it's been pretty good. It's just that... You know, when I'm using, when someone else is using the War Machine's arsenal or like a whole team is using it, it just completely destroys my entire base. Even while I'm playing in zero, I mean not zero build, especially when I'm playing in build, which is insane, you know. Uh, even with metal, it, it still like destroys me. But that's pretty much it for that one. And it seems like there is more changes too. So it seems like in, uh, in tournament loot pools, so like in like, um, you know, tournament matches, uh, this seems to be taking out the, uh, they, the War Machine's arsenal. So they re they removed the jetpack, the, the automated turret, and the backpack. And it seems like it took out the rockets and the, you know, the gauntlets, the War Machine gauntlets. And they also vaulted the shotgun grenades from tournaments that have building en enabled. And I don't know why they took out shockwaves. I mean, like... You know, it's for mobility, so I don't really understand that. I don't know why they didn't take out um, Captain America's shield, so that's interesting. That's, that's that's pretty much it for that one. And to top it all off uh, for today's video, um, there is new challenges for, the, for Fortnite this week. So it seems like the first challenge is eliminate an opponent with Dr. Doom's Monarch Pistol, which is the new pistol that came out. It does crazy damage, as have you guys seen through my live streams, my recent one especially. Reach 10 players in remaining, which is pretty easy. You could do it in Battle Royale. And travel travel distance while airborne in a vehicle, which is also pretty easy. They have those um, those circle boosters, the those uh, rings that uh, boost up your vehicle. And search chests within when in named locations, which is pretty easy. It's just searching up locations. You, I mean, searching chests in locations. You could do that in Team Rumble. That's pretty easy. Eliminate opponents, that's, that could be done in Team Rumble, and collect common or uncommon weapons. 
So it looks like this week is going to be pretty simple. There's also a new story uh, challenges too. So if you guys want to check that out, um, just do them really quickly because they give out a lot of XP. I think like 10,000. So yeah, that's pretty much it for today's video. Thanks for joining. Uh, thanks for joining me for my first ever video on Fortnite patch notes. I haven't done one in like about like three, no, four years since my last one. You know, it's crazy. And so, you know, I hope you guys have a good day. Please like and subscribe. Help the channel out, please. And um, I hope you all take it easy. See you later, guys.